I'm Dr. Arvinder Soyan. Today we are going to talk about living donor liver transplantation. This is an operation by which a life-saving liver transplant can be done for patients with liver failure and liver cancer, taking half of a family member's liver as the donor organ. What is done is that the patient and the donor will first undergo evaluation to see that it is safe for them to undergo donor surgery and transplant surgery and that they match up in terms of liver size and anatomy. Who can be a donor? The person must be from the family, either a spouse or brother, sister, son, daughter, parent, grandparent, grandchild, cousin, uncle, aunt. They should be 18 to 55 years old. Their blood group should be the same as the recipients or blood group O, which is universal donor. And they should not be overweight by more than 10%. Then what we do is, the liver is situated here. The donor and the patient undergo simultaneous surgery in two operating rooms adjacent to each other. We remove the right side of the donor's liver in the operating room for an adult transplantation and the left side of the donor's liver for a pediatric transplantation or for a child and put that half into the patient's abdomen after removing the patient's bad liver. This is called living donor liver transplant. After the surgery, the donor is discharged in about five to seven days and the patient is discharged in about 10 to 15 days. Over a long experience of 3,700 living donor liver transplantations uh, by me and my team, we have now a success rate of 95% in adults and 97% in children, and donors are all safe. The donor gets back to their normal life within a month. They do not need any follow-up or further treatment beyond 20 days. And the patient gets back to their normal life in about two months. But the patient will need one or two life-saving immunosuppressive drugs for the rest of their life. But the quality and expectancy of life in the donor and the patient remains absolutely normal after transplantation. 